Listen to this if you're under tremendous financial pressure now. This isn't for everybody, but uh, this is an important story I'm about to tell you. It's a story of my life, but more importantly, it's a story of reinventing yourself. Reinventing yourself. It's Memorial Day is coming up. The summer is here. It's a new, almost a new season in life. And um, if you feel stuck financially, this is as good a time as ever to reinvent yourself financially. So here's what happened to me. Like I grew up, you know, single mom. Uh, my dad was in prison when I was a little kid. And so <clears throat> looking back now, I realized I didn't get stuff that people get that have a more stable family and have grow up with a dad. You know, you get kind of mentorship. But the good news is I kind of reinvented myself. When I graduated high school, I decided I was going to go out and find mentors. And I found my first mentor, a guy named Joel Salatin. And then um, I started a business with him when I was 19, and, and it was profitable. Um, not real profitable. I made like $12,000. And <clears throat> I think the total business made fifty or 60000 in in nine months. And I, it was pretty good. It gave me confidence. And with that 12000 I said, I'm going to double down on this mentor thing. I'm going to find a guide. Um, and I started traveling the world. I've been to over 40 countries. I went to Tasmania and Argentina and Ireland and all these places, wherever I could find somebody who was smart, especially about money, life in general. But at that point I needed a career. And so sure enough, I found more mentors. I ended up finding five, um, mentors, millionaire mentors of different levels. Some making a ton of money and all of them had their life together and had their finances together. And so if you haven't had that story, you're missing out. If that story hasn't happened to you, if you can't look back to specific points and go, meeting this person transformed my life and meeting this person transformed my life, you're missing out. And if you're suffering now financially or if you're doing okay financially, but you're not doing amazing, I just wanna tell you a new season can come, but you have to commit yourself to reinventing yourself. So I feel, I feel the pain because I've been in that place with pain financially. And um, there's a lot of different pain you can have. All of them are bad. You can have, you know, somebody breaks up with you, that's pain. You can have health issues. That's certainly about as much pain as you can have. But finance and the stress, I mean, they say, number one cause of divorce, financial stress. How many times have you laid in bed wondering how you're gonna pay the next bill, whatever it is, your rent or whatever. So if you're there, I feel the pain because I had the pain. I saw my mom go through the pain. She's a single mom, right? She never made more like 20 grand a year. She used to leave me with a babysitter. If she couldn't find a babysitter sometimes, she'd just leave me kind of by myself. And so I've seen the impact of that. And my dad's from Harlem, you know, even my dad's side, they didn't have much money. My dad's from Lexington and 160th or something in New York, Harlem. So here's what happens with the transformation. And the reason I'm bringing this up on Memorial Day is because like, I like to find landmarks, moments in time where you go, enough is enough. I'm reinventing myself financially. Or it can be other areas. You can reinvent yourself, your body, if you're super overweight or out of shape or whatever. You can reinvent your love life if you're always getting your heart broken or you have horrible relationships. You can reinvent your happiness if you're always depressed and anxious. But I'm just speaking on money because that's the number one thing people ask me about because I'm an entrepreneur. People ask, like, how did you reinvent yourself? So, number one, pick a landmark. It can be anything. For me, the first time was like graduating high school. It's like a landmark. Oh, a new season of my life. But if you read the story of Michael Jordan, a basketball player, to win, he always was looking for some new landmark to reinvent himself. Maybe it was he'd read a newspaper article where someone, the other player, talk crap about him and he'd be like, oh, I'm going to play extra hard for that. So I'm giving you summer, Memorial Day, time to reinvent yourself, a new season of life. Winter's done. Spring's done. Now's the fun time. Summer. That's where everything happens, you know? And instead of being like everybody else and just playing around and just traveling, you can do all that stuff. But why not reinvent how you make money? Reinvent your career. Reinvent your job. 80% of people, they say, don't like their job. And by the way, that's not just the United States. That's almost every country in the world. And so here's, so step number one, pick a landmark to reinvent yourself financially. Step number two, you need guides. Okay, you need guides. And step number three, I think you need four guides. Now, I went on after that first mentor, Joel Salatin. I found all these other mentors. But about 
six, seven years ago, I wanted to reinvent myself again. You, you never can stop. <laughs> the world changes fast. If you're not continually reinventing yourself, uh, you get behind. And so I realized the world changed. Social media is big. E-commerce is big. Look at me. Toys R Us is out of business. JCPenney, Sears, all these kind of uh, uh, traditional businesses are gone because e-commerce. And of course, social media, we know. Biggest thing in terms of getting people's attention ever in the history of humans. And the third thing I realized when I was starting out, you need to have some credit so you can buy a car, so you can buy a house, so you can get a loan, all those things. So you, third thing is you, you got to get credit up. And then the fourth thing is you got to know what to invest in. And it, can, it should, I like to invest online, but I also like to invest in physical assets like real estate. So those are the four things that I started learning back when I was 19, but there was no social media and e-commerce really. I mean, there was, but it wasn't as big as it is now. So about six, seven years ago, I reinvented myself. Now, I was ahead of the curve on that. But I'm going to tell you right now, if you're watching this, uh, you should jump on the curve because the curve, it's still ahead of the curve now. Still ahead of, you could be ahead of the curve if you can get a guide on those four things. So, so basically, the way to think about it is, if you don't like your income, um, well then, you want to reinvent your job by working yourself out of a job by owning the company. So starting a little business at home. And what do you start it around? Online, it's the simplest thing. You got a laptop, you got internet, you're in business. You can be living anywhere in the world too. If you live outside the US, you could sell into the US from any country in the world. So online, that's e-commerce. That's why Jeff Bezos is the richest man, $150 million, a billion dollars net worth. Now, how do you get people to visit your online store? Social media marketing, that's number two. And by the way, you can also use social media to generate your first income by basically starting a social media marketing agency. But e-commerce, social media. Then, how do you get the initial funds to do that? How do you live in the meanwhile? Well, I'm not saying you wanna go in debt and get credit, uh, getting you know get a whole bunch of credit cards and put it all on credit cards. No, you gotta do that wisely and strategically. It can be okay, but you gotta be in control. But you still gotta get your credit score up. These are the four guides that you need to reinvent yourself financially right now in this summer. Starting today, I'm going to give you a way to do it. And then lastly, you need to learn how to invest in real estate. The most millionaires in the world come from real estate. It's simple. There's billion. It's not the most billionaires. Most billionaires now are coming from online, e-commerce, and social media. But not everybody needs to be a billionaire, right? That's not the goal of life to become a billionaire. If it happens, it happens. Great. More to give away to help other people, right? That's what... Uh, that's what the best people do who become a billionaire. They use it as a platform to help other people. But that's not realistic that most people are going to become billionaires. Even millionaires is hard. But there's a lot. There's millions of millionaires in the world. And the primary reason is because somebody mentored them and gave them a guide to at least two or three or four out of these, uh, uh, two or three of these four things. So did they teach this in college? How can you go learn it now? Um, they don't teach in college. I, I was at a hotel. I was visiting my 101 year old grandma. My grandma's 101. It's kind of cool. Although she says she doesn't like being that old. And the valet at the hotel right by my grandma said, um, Ty, I want you to know I've been watching your videos and I think you're right. I said, what do you think I'm right about? He goes, well, I think I got scammed at college. He said, I went to, I think he went to San Diego State or USD, University of San Diego. And he said, I got a marketing degree in four years. They never taught social media class. I said, oh, they never taught like a semester, you know, on social media. He said, no, they were never even taught one class. So you can try to learn these four things, social media, e-commerce, credit, and um, real estate. You can try to learn them from schools. You can try to learn from books. I love books, but the problem with books is they're out of date. I remember reading a social media book that was telling you advice on how to use Meerkat. Well, Meerkat has been, um, <laughs> bankrupt for many years. It's gone. It's like how to use Vine. Vine doesn't exist anymore, really, right? Uh, TikTok, I guess. Um, so you could try to learn a book, but the books don't have it. Try to learn at university. You can try to find mentors who can mentor you in all four of those things. And some of you will pull it off. It took me like five or 10 years to find the mentors because I had to travel to them and they were busy. And yeah, but I'm gonna give you a simplest way that you can do right now. So I did this back on Black Friday last year. 
I did, I took my four guides that I built, four online programs that you can learn right on your phone. You can download them today. They're videos, audios, PDFs, and training completely anywhere from one to four months of training. You don't have to even go through the whole training, but in-depth training on e-commerce, social media marketing, um, credit repair, and lastly, real estate investing, and how to do all those things if you're starting from scratch like I do with not a lot of money, maybe no money and no experience and no one believing in you and all the stress in the world on you. So I'm gonna open this up for Memorial Day. Now, depending on when you're watching this, uh, you got less than seven days to get in because I'm opening, I'm bundling these four programs that I have. They normally sell for 500 bucks each, that's $2,000. I'm gonna bundle them all together, okay? And not even charge you, you know, 500 bucks. So I'm gonna, you're gonna get like whatever, 80% discount. Or if you're just interested in one of the four guides, one of the four programs, you can just mix and match, okay? But I'm only gonna do it at this price. I'm gonna do partial scholarships. I'm gonna pay, I'm gonna cover most of the cost. Like college covers most of the cost. It's not really a cost they're covering, right? They're just discounting it. So this is a partial scholarship. Um, instead of paying, I think it's like 2,100 or 2,000 bucks, um, you're gonna get these. Oh, it's right at about 2,000 bucks. You're gonna get these for less than 500 bucks. So you got less than seven days, okay? The page will explain it. It's free to go to this page, read about it, or you might have to swipe up or click on the corners here, uh, or there might be a link in the description, depending on if you're on your phone or laptop or whatever. So I hope this will be a year of transformation for you. Man, don't give up. Don't give up. Somebody asked me, Ty, what, was, what advice would you give yourself at 18 years old? It's just what I told you. Hey, it will be number one, find guides written by good mentors. By the way, these programs, uh, the social media marketing and e-commerce I launched years ago. They're pr all of these years ago. They have, uh, I think the social media marketing almost has 50,000 people I've trained in 90 countries. Let me put, I'm gonna have them cut in a little video, some testimonials of people uh, getting Results. Hey, Ty and team. Tristan Larson here. I'm excited to say I'm sitting in my brand new C Class 250. I know it's not a Lambo, but it's an upgrade from a Honda Civic. Six months ago, I was working at a birthday party place, had kids kick me all the time. I was tired of it, and I was tired of being average. Now I'm on track to make six figures, and I made 7.2K last month. I'm about three quarters of the way through the social media marketing agency program, and I just want to say that I just last week closed down my first $1,000 a month contract. Now I'm at $10,000 a month. I'm earning $10,000 a month, and it only took me a few months. In just a month, I've already increased my income by $2,500. My agency has gone from zero to $5,000 a month, and I've only completed 11% of the course. $35,000 a month. We used to make minimum wage. Now we're doing over $70,000 a month. I'm not promising you're going to get the exact results. I've seen crazy results. I've seen people go from rags to riches. Most people don't, though. But it's possible. The information you're about to get access to, it works. And people say, no, it doesn't. Don't believe it. It worked for me. You don't think social media transformed my life? E-commerce transformed my life? I'm on social media, you've probably seen me before. Do you think that's had effect on my income? Yes. Reaching more people with social media? Yeah. Social media marketing? Building a social media marketing agency? I would wager, well, 40,000 plus people went through my social media marketing agency. I'm trying to put together the statistics of the success rate. All I know, it's insane and more than I can keep track of. Now, not everybody gets success with these programs. I'm not going to lie to you. This isn't some guaranteed get rich quick thing. But I'll tell you this. The people who actually apply themselves and apply themselves and commit to reinventing their life, I consistently see results. Crazy results sometimes. You'll see in these videos. Now, I can hear the naysayers. There's always naysayers and people say, ah, oh, this doesn't work. It's too late. That's a common question. It's not too late. It's not too late. You're gonna look back in 20 years. It's like real estate. Uh, I asked my mom, how can we never, because we lived in like not a very nice neighborhood. In, I was born in Long Beach. And I'm like, why didn't you buy one of these junky houses? Not when she was like struggling with me, but as she got a little bit older, she got a little bit of money. I mean, enough to buy, like you could buy a house for like 80 grand. She's like, well, it seemed too high. It was like, it was too late. No, it wasn't too late. Looking back on opportunities, you should get in. What's the old saying? The best time to plant a tree is 20 years ago or today. 
or as my first mentor, Joel Salatin, used to tell me, better late than never. So if you're not in understanding e-commerce, better late than never. Today's your day. If you're not understanding social media, better late than never. If you're broke, better late than never. It would have been better you fixed this 20 years ago, but the school system sucked. Most parents aren't equipped to do it. You're in a unique time right now. A unique time where through your phone, through your laptop, you can download information. 30 years ago, you couldn't download a video course. I mean, I guess they had DVDs. Something like that. But there's no social media to reach people. You could build a business and then you could never get any customers because you had to buy like a TV ad or a billboard and it was expensive. So only the wealthy could get wealthier. But right now there's a transformation happening in the world. They call it new money. Some people don't like that, oh, new money. Well, new money's better, just as good as old money. Inheriting money from parents doesn't make the world a better place if that's how all people got their money. We need new money. I guess you need old money too. But I hope maybe you'll be new money. You will be the one in your family. You'll be the one in your friends who transform their lives faster than everyone else. Jump in. You got less than seven days. Click the link below or here. People go, oh, Ty. You know, I, I'm not used to spending this. I could, I can down, I can just watch this all free on YouTube. Oh, not really. Remember, I don't teach all these programs: the e-com, the social media, the credit repair, the um, real estate. I bring in the smartest people that I know, that friends, allies, business partners, and they teach. You know, like for example, in the e-commerce, my business partner Alex teaches. Do you think he knows about e-commerce? He just sold his company for $255 million last year, quarter of a billion dollars, more than quarter of a billion last month. You think he's in a university setting? He don't have time, he don't have time to read a book. But I get there, I get them to do me favors and teach in this program. So you're gonna learn from not just me, because I don't know everything. A lot of stuff I don't know. In fact, you don't have to know a lot of stuff to be successful financially. You just got to have a, what Warren Buffett, the billionaire, calls a small circle of competence. Know what it is and stay within it. My circle of competence is social media marketing, e-commerce. I do real estate. I do it in a different way. I'm going to teach you. What I do is more complicated. I buy raw land and stuff in agricultural land. Um, I bought like seven, almost 1,000 acres last in the last year or so. I'm, I'm going to teach you. A, I'm bringing in my friends who do like simpler stuff that you can just start out with. I started out with real estate over 10 years ago. I've never been full-time real estate guy, but I've always been part-time. And I did little fix and flips and rentals. And so we'll teach all that stuff. Credit repair, I've got people gonna teach, you're gonna blow your mind. If you got crappy credit, get your credit up. It'll help you. Just be disciplined, don't use it to go, you know gamble in Vegas on your credit cards. I don't even know if you can do that. They don't accept credit cards. I don't think it's against the law or something. But, so that's the second question. Oh, so I was saying the price, like, um, it's cheap. You're getting about a year's worth of curriculum material, okay? You're getting a year's worth of curriculum material on four massive subjects financially. So what's that come out to? You're getting it for under 500 bucks. A dollar something a day, not even to, let's say a dollar fifty a day. Well, I got a money back guarantee too. My refund rate is insanely low because once you get in these programs, you're gonna be like, "Wow, this is a lot of good stuff." And all you have to do, so I answered that question about the price. It's cheap, it's a buck and a half a day. Okay, I don't know. You can, thirty bucks a month, forty bucks a month, and if you just buy one of the guides. It's not even that. So what else are you going to do with that money? People always waste their money. I mean, I know you got to buy food and you got to pay rent and pay bills, but people all, another thing Joel Salatin taught me, my first mentor, Ty, people always have money sitting around somewhere for the things that they really commit to. That's why I said, are you committed to a new season, to reinventing yourself and transformational uh, moment in time in your life where you'll look back on this year. I, you know, it's funny. I spoke at Grant Cardone. He had this 10X conference. It was huge. It was like he sold 30,000 tickets or something in Miami. And there, afterwards, I got off the stage and, and a woman came up to me. And she said, Ty, I want you to know you changed my life. I watched one of these videos, just like what you're watching right now. She lived in India. She said, I was able, I graduated college. And in India, a good job for me was, I think, 700 bucks a month. That's a really good job. 
She said, I got in your programs, I think e-commerce. She started doing drop shipping. She's like, I'm making four to $6,000 a month. Four to $6,000 a month in India? That's like making like 40,000 in America. So she goes, I was able to buy a ticket because I want to come see you. And I wanted to tell you, you told us in the video, write today's date down and I did. I forget what it was, like February, 2017. And here I am and my life's transformed. I reinvented myself. And she said, my family doesn't even know what to think because they wanted me to go the traditional route, but I'm gonna warn you. And that's what I told her. And I'll tell you right now, the traditional way isn't working anymore. If you were born in the 1950s, I'd be like, go to college, get a bachelor's degree, get a job. You'd be pretty much safe. You get a pension. Look at the world now. The world's chaotic financially. It's dog eat dog. It's always been a little dog eat dog, but it's um, the security's pulled out from under your rug. I mean, uh, the rug's pulled out from under you, I should say. That security's pulled out from you. It, so when you don't know, there's a famous person, I forget who said this, it wasn't Einstein. Said maybe it was Steve Jobs. The best way to predict the future is create the future yourself. Best way to predict your financial success is just create it yourself. And I'm not even saying you have to quit your job. You can do this part time. Lots of people, tens of thousands of people. I've had over a quarter million people go through my paid uh, programs in just the last three or four years. And um, a lot of them do it part time. Not everybody quits their job. You can, don't have to go cold turkey. You can ease into it. But best way to predict your financial future or the transformation is just create it. I'm gonna show you how to create it. Step by step, if you have no experience, if you don't understand real estate, you don't understand e-commerce, you don't understand social media, you don't understand credit, I'm gonna give it to you in the simplest way. So simple, all you gotta do, when you click the link below, you get in the programs, you can pick the entire bundle, and you can save whatever, 80, 70% or something. Or you can just pick individual ones, mix and match, like a shopping cart. And in five minutes from now, you'll be in their training. Five minutes. I feel like I'm about to sneeze. Drink some water. People ask me, Ty, why don't you edit stuff like that? I'm like, ah, who cares? You can see the real behind the scenes, right? I'm in London, by the way. I got an office here in London. It's one of the things that keeps me excited. I like new things. I'm an explorer. There's a personality type in this test. And I test as an explorer. I like doing new stuff. But I'll tell you, the fuel of living an exciting life is financial freedom. The fuel is financial in nature. It's good to have health. It's good to be happy. It's good to have love. But boy, as we all know, if you're watching this far, you're watching because you got that financial pressure on you. Take it as a moment in time like Michael Jordan did, like I did, and say, new season's begun. It's Memorial Day. That's your new season. It's summertime. That's your new season. Okay? You got less than seven days to get in. If not, it's going to go up and each of these programs is going to quadruple the price. For those of you who get in, um, write me an email, Ty, Ty Lopez, when you start getting some success. Send me a case study, a picture, your first sale, your first customer, if you get in social media marketing, like something. Just so, even if it's a little baby step. People send them to me every day. It fascinates me. It's, the, it's a highlight of my day, every day. So for those of you who don't get in, good luck out there. Good luck out there. It's a jungle. For those of you who do, who do get in, this is a guide to the jungle. All right? Talk to you soon.